you don't have the Scotty bar, you're oh, absolutely not. The instant response. Okay, so what's going mid now? I have. No it's either idea. Clock Core, Witch, Witch Doctor. What, what do you mean? It's either. It's Clock Carrie, Witch Doctor. Oh my Diracho fucking Witch god. Oh. I'm living for free on, on Diracho. They're starting to get the dive going top. Both level three now. Clockwork and Dark Steer. This is the kill threat. Saberlight. They glyph the wave. See you later. I mean, they're, they're really. It's just only so much you can do as a Doom now, right? Yeah. Against these two. A little bit top lane. Trying okay. to go on to Tofu. Ace Dodges. is going to make his way over to help out. Indeed, the arrow won't connect. Crit jumps forward with the Star Storm to bring Tofu low. Nice. They'll get the kill. Saberlight. I mean, same time. Shop of Fire Rebellion. They're going to bring the numbers down bottom. Saberlight will fall, but down on the bottom lane. Shop of Fire. Now find Duraccio. Nicely done. We'll get the track. Sounds so clowny, of course, because there's like this do carry watch oh, doctor. Top line. Oh, he's joking. Hiding in the trees here. Saberlight will find him. Nicely done, Saberlight. And, uh, yeah, stand on top of him with the Scorched Earth. Should easily give them enough damage to take him out through the range of the, the Doom. Quinn turns up, but uh, nothing he can do to help out. I've never seen it before, but I guess because the Doom's like jungling and stuff, he wants to be able to take towers. Cool. Quinn? Oh, nice oh, arrow. Lovely arrow from Crit. Uh, making up for those earlier missed ones. Agreed. He, he's, he's really at that sort of start. Quick TP up towards the top. you got Tofu trying to make a move onto Sableye. Sableye will go down. See Ace, drop the wall, but Mikey turns up, drops down a tornado and gets the trade. Take Sableye's here. They're going to start going straight for him. The question is if Gaming Gladiators are going to be able to head over and help out. Duraccio getting dove. Arrow hits perfectly. He's gone. Let's see if Gaming Gladiators can fight back here, Ace. Trying to get in prime position for a good setup. He's in on top of Mikey. Mikey will be protected by the disruption. We'll see Saberlight go straight towards Quinn, but the tether and the heels are there from Celery. Celery keeping Quinn alive. They'll lose Mikey, Shopify. And the hook. Forward, Tofu. He closes the gap on Saberlight. Cogs it down. The hammer there as well. Saberlight will fall. As Bits Gaming Gladiators, ready. they react. They take two and maybe even more. Straight away, they charge over towards Fly in the Trees. A third kill for Gaming Gladiators as they respond. Uh, it, it pretty much... Timings are soon going to be hit together here. I believe the pipe is coming out soon for the Darkseer. Quinn on his way to Bloodstone. Kind of ramping things up. Duraccio, Max, Heal, and Mech. They want more. Oh, he's just going to start running at them. Look at the just down to Sableye. The Death Ward's there. Fly, he'll try and buy some time for Sableye with the disruption, but only means that he gets destroyed by the Death Ward and indeed with the Maledict on Sableye. He's also going to fall incredibly low. Hookshot fall from Tofu. Trapping Saberlight in the car. Saberlight goes down. Quinn steps in. They're closing the gap on Crit and Mikey. They've got to run Shopify. But Mikey, he cannot escape the last rack. Another kill for Quinn. Three dead once again on Shopify. So much damage was he's been pumped up with so much heals. Crit. Oh, he knows. Uh, he knew. That Goodbye, stun would have indeed hit. So Crit, his only option out of there was to cancel the TP and keep running. But Duraccio, Cask and a Maledict, Crit's gone. <laughs> oh my. He cannot stop moving around. Maybe, honestly, maybe he might not be able to go for the Midas. This might be necessary, but... Relocate. I mean, they're trying to go for Tofu. Get him. They will get him. Disruption holds back Quinn. Should give the, them a bit of space here to back up. And indeed, shop a fire belly, and they'll get the kill. and Get his items online. But at the same time, you know, like I said, the Darkseer will be able to scale versus that as well. As big as the TP gets. Ace. We'll find him here. It's relatively tanky with a completed pipe. We'll get the wall down. But I won't survive. Ace, taken out. Crit. So he's got, got the hook shot up. See what he wants to go for here. He's going to go for Crit. And Mikey. Crit still has a leap available. Back over in the mid. Mikey's holding them away. They get the tornado. Harrow. Not going to quite connect. Doom's going to get laid down, but there's oh, a lot he... of sustaining from Celery, so he's able to walk away. He baited it. Uh, did you see Quinn's movement? He walked back in, like saying... He certainly does. Another sudden strike. They know, they, they know how low it's getting. See if Crick can time it. Arrow, he's in. He jumps, but he doesn't get it. Doesn't get it. And they're after The him. kill goes for Gaming Gladiators, and Quinn gets the Aegis. The Death Doors drop down the mech. We'll save Crit. Okay. It was a good attempt. It was a close one as well. He nearly had it there, Crit. Tofu setting up on our TZ. The relocate. Here it comes. Let's see if Fly can help out. There's only so much he can do to hold them back. Good disruption. He's going to buy him a little extra time. We'll be able to get the Thunder off our TZ. And we'll manage to turn, actually, take down Celery. In fact, he's able to TP out as well. Oh, no, he wants to stick around. Here's he's got Mikey. the backup of Mikey. They could try and go for a third one here. They're looking towards Quinn. Artizi's in onto Quinn. The Tornado's there, but Ice comes in with a vacuum wall. 
Quinn still alive in the midst of it all. all this RTZ falls. Ace, he's ready for the cleanup himself. Chases down Fly. Mikey will manage to TP out. That looked to be maybe an opportunity to get away with something with the Doom with uh, Dragio on his own. But he's indeed, look at them run at them. The five man here at Gaming Gladiator is going straight over towards Mikey and Stabilite. As Mikey caught in the cogs. Quinn perfect with the timing. Relent. Let's see. Because gaming, 20 seconds still left on the stages. Will Shopify be able to punish? It looks like they're going to try to time a move here with that Aegis kind of ticking out soon. I mean, Sableye's ready to go in on this. The Aegis. We'll drop down the Doom. Six seconds on Aegis. It's very hard to, to fight through these two. They, they've ideally got to really find Celery. Deafening Blast from Mikey will catch on to Celery, but the Tether's back up. He's over to the high ground towards Tofu. They're turning. So your hook shot in aggressively. Tofu over to what Stabilite. Arteezy's wrapping around from the side. They'll lose the two. You see the vacuum in the, the meter hammer. hammer. Ace with the setup onto Arteezy. They'll lose Celery. Quinn? See if Shopify Rebellion can keep pushing through this as they've taken out Quinn. Bombing. See if they can get anything more, Tofu. Blocking off the, the entrance of the high ground here with the cogs. And Duracha has turned up. He's a bit late, though. And they still want to go in Shopify Rebellion. The Voodoo Switcheroo here used aggressively over towards Arteezy. But Duracha, he's going to die as well. Big moves. Ah, uh, Sunstrike's coming in. Quinn, he's gone. They weren't able to relocate him out in time there. Oh a my god. I think Saberlight and Arteezy can go and then Mikey can TP in. But it they, is they, dropping. They've got to go soon if they want to do do something. And yeah, they're not, okay. they're not going to be able to interrupt this. So, Gaming Gladiators, they get the space to get that Aegis secure on Quinn. Shopify looks pretty keen to fight anyway, though. All lingering together. Saberlight's in. in. He's going to make the jump. Doom. He's going to drop the Doom down onto Ace. Make sure this Dark Seer does not get to play the fight at all as Ace goes down. See, Quinn, he's just going to opt for a BKB TP out. They don't want to try and take this fight, Gaming Gladiators. But Duraccio will be left behind as Shopify Rebellion. They'll be able to find three from this. Tofu, dead as well. There we go. That's the impact, Doom. And Saberlight drops the Bing Bong. Because <laughs> that's the perfect one he can catch. The Dark Seer gets absolutely nothing off. And they'll get the IO. Alrighty. I mean, they're, they're really just playing this fantastic. I mean, in with the Moonlight Shadow and Stabilite. Another Doom. Straight away. Locks it down onto Ace. Make sure that there's going to be space for them to try and make some, some sort of play happen without the threat of the Darks here. And indeed, they'll, they'll be able to take out Tofu. If I can surround this and get the numbers. Quinn. They've got him. He is super dead. Caught by the Doom. Mikey even sweeping the upper tree line just in case there was anyone else trying to back him up. They see Tofu. He's got no TP. But he is sneaking away with his jetpack. Well, they might not want to spend Three and Duraccio. Yeah, they're still in the area. And Duraccio is going to get caught by the setup of the Tornado. Deafening Blast is going to be off the mark. Stabilite commits him to the BKB over towards Celery. Celery will take the two of them out of there. Nicely done. He's TPing over to try to help him. Duracho wants to give him a tether target, but I don't, I don't know if Celery's Yeah, I don't think there's any help in this poor old Aya. As the arrow connects, Celery's gone. Shop for fire about. That's a lot of money. Ace. Not easy. Oh! oh. They're gonna be, be able to drag him back into the combo a little Arteezy? bit. I mean, he should be fine with the Thunder. Oh. Jesus. I mean, they're, they're still trying to force it it's towards position. Arteezy. They go for it, but there's Fly with the disruption. Every time. Saves him from the stun. Arteezy's able to put the BKB in now. Mikey, he's going to be ready to help turn around. He drops the meteor down. Quinn's gone. They push too hard there for a bit of an aggressive play game in Gladiators. They couldn't quite kill Arteezy. And they'll drop the voodoo switcheroo. But vacuum as well. Arteezy's getting low. But the disruption again. Again and again. Fly just bailing Arteezy out every single time. They cannot fight this game in Gladiators. Arteezy getting low, but he will not die. They just don't have it in them anymore, this game, Gaming Gladiators. They cannot take a team fight. They Stop a fire can. belly, and they're too far ahead. Aggressive Sunder as well, bringing Tofu down low. Jump four from Mikey. They're ready to finish off Tofu as well. Such good gameplay from Shopify. I mean, gaming. I mean, they'll try and get her in time, but Mikey. He knows he's already able to hold them back with the tornado. They're still trying to close in on this. And Quinn. He's just in. He's going to go in with the BKB. He's just dying. But I mean, Arteezy just does so much damage. I don't know if they can keep Quinn alive. They can't. Quinn's gone. As Arteezy is too big right now. They cannot fight this Terra Blade. Celery will be able to snatch the Aegis. <laughs> it, it's cute, but it ain't going to turn this game around. As the Dooms drop down onto Ace, the Darkseer's out. 
Duraccio, also not a chance in this fight. Triple kill for Arteezy. I mean, this game's over, This Fog. game is over. Probably just discussing a couple things here, last moments there on Gaming Gladiators, but that is totally it. Ultra kill for Arteezy. The final effort, Duraccio. Farewell. Now, goodbye. Deleted. Ah, uh, that's the carry. <laughs> carry Witch Doctor. Quinn. Doomed again. It's just too much damage from the Stereoblade. Quinn's gone. They'll buy back on Duraccio, but there's no buyback available on Quinn. Ace just wants to use his wall, but he can't even get the connection. It would have just died to a Dagon anyway, but... Teezy's just gonna walk in. I just lost the BKB straight away. Mm -hmm. They threw the Lincolns on him also, I believe, to block the cast. Terra Wave to zone them. Ace. And he's gonna get in with the punch. <laughs> Dagon. And Duraccio, he's trying to step in with the BKB. He'll put the voodoo switcheroo, but unfortunately that doesn't switch the hero he's playing. As the Witch Doctor carry goes down. And I'm sure we'll see the G soon. Yeah. There we go. GG, it's called Shopify Rebellion. Take this game one. I mean, gaming gladiators, we all love to see it. We're all excited to see it. Some uh, carry Witch Doctor. But maybe this game, it was indeed a mean too far, folks. Maybe a little bit, but I have to give enormous respect to the way that Shopify was playing. As they crossed right? it like, on all accounts. There's tons of movement happening. You can see the Gladiators, they're looking to set pace. They get the Roches, but it ends up not mattering because Shopify, they understood their win condition. Get Midas's, farm it up, split push. Don't let them force you your high ground ever. Don't end up losing too many fights. Never really dying, backing up Arteezy perfectly. 14, 1 and 12.